Hi everyone, welcome to my corner of the internet, where we are once again playing some Fatal Frame 3, The Tormented. As evidenced by the sound in the background, I'm being hunted by a big bad ghostie that I really don't want to have to deal with. So, um, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to leave the dream. I, I was thinking about this, I'm like, ah, how am I going to handle this? Uh, I think we're going to head north, we're going to exit the dream and then come back in. And that should also re, um, reset our, our, our uh, candle, you know, the purifying light. And then after that, we got a book that we want to bring back to the library, and that's what we we're going to do. So that's the game plan. Let's go ahead and try to try to try to do that. So, um, yep, I don't like him. He is spoopy. He is very spoopy, and he stopped chasing me. Okay, well that's convenient. Uh, yeah, let's go outside. I believe I may have just gotten my my candle refilled or whatever, but. Um, <laughs> It's fine. Like, it, it's, it's like, whatever. We're, we are refilling it again, and I get away from the ghost. So, sure. Why not? Let's, let's, let's do that. Um, so yeah. That's what we're doing today. We're gonna go bring the thing back to the, um, the library and, uh, see where that, where that takes us. Uh, I've been doing a lot of, uh, no, I think we keep going. I think, yeah, I, th I, th I think... We want to keep going. This this door here leads back to the rest of the manor of sleep. If I recall correctly, I'm trying to I'm trying to avoid checking the map every two seconds. I feel like I lose a lot of time by being lost, and so I figured you know let's let's just stop using a tool that prevents you from getting lost. Type 14 film. Um, excellent. We've got some um, more film. Uh, but yeah, I uh, I uh, I I think I mentioned it a little bit last time. Where I've been kind of revisiting the other games, um, like like generally, you know, for recording and stuff, you want there to be, uh, you know, quiet. You know, you don't want uh, dist disturbances and stuff because it's just it's it's not good. It's not good for recording and it sucks. So um, when I can't get to a quiet place to sit down and just record video game uh, for all of you, I. Uh, uh, I don't even know if this is the right way. Whatever. Whatever. I'm, j I'm just running. I'm just running randomly through this place, and hopefully I'll end up in the right spot. Like, I'm just hoping, you know what, let's, do, let's let the game's funneling do the work for me. At some point, the game will be like, you can't go, don't, no, you can't go this way, and I'll be like, alright, I can't go that way. Um, that's a, that's a stupid way to do things. <laughs> like, I should really figure out where the, the library is. I'm pretty sure the library's... Storehouse hallway? No, that, that, this leads down. We don't want to go down. We want to go straight and go up to this place, the kimono room, and work our way back down, something like that. I think. I think that's what we want to do. Yes. But yeah, so, like, you know, when I, when I haven't been able to actually record, I'm like, you know what, let's go back and play the other Fatal Frame games. And that, that will help me kind of do a, a bit of a comparison, right? You know, because I feel like when you played, um, I, I thought, like, I, I was like, oh, yeah, I, uh, you know, I just played through number two. It's fresh in my mind. I, I don't need a refresher on that, but you know what? No, I kind of did. Uh, it's amazing how you get sort of uh, used to um, how like this game is, and you kind of forget how the other ones. Like I had mentioned in a um, this one's closed off, isn't it? I, I seem to remember this one being closed off, right? Because because the obvious path is not. Yep. You can't take the obvious path. Um, but yeah, so like you get used to how things are, and then you're playing through them, and you're like, "No, wait, this is this is uh, this is wrong. <laughs> this this does not feel right." Uh, I feel so freaking lost. All right, there is this door here. Oh man, see, my, my candle's gonna run out before I even get to the place. See, that's what I feel like this game does. Um, all right, I'm actually, I'm actually going to see. This confuses me because there's no actual set of stairs here on the map. That's what's really confusing me here is that they had, there was no actual set of stairs on the map and so that's really confusing. Um, okay, so let's 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 organize my thoughts. Uh, let's start with the, the big one, the one that's uh, I feel like it kind of stands on its own without comparing um, Fatal Frame 3 to any of the others. The library. First, I, I need to locate where the library is. Uh, I seem to recall it being close to, like, all the, um, stairs and crap. I could be wrong. Is it down this way? Stairs hallway? 
All right, there's the library. Manor sleep, second floor, library. Coming down, that's in the blind room. So we want to head to the blind room. To do so, we start up here where we are. We go directly to through the door to our right down here, over this way, over this way, whoop, up here, and from there we can find the library. All right, cool. To the right. Right, Miku. There we go. Uh, I feel what my, my main problem with uh, this game here is, is mostly the manner of sleep. Um, I, I love I love like Ray's apartment sections, like her her place. Um, apartment. Oh, what the heck? What the holy? What the almighty holy crap? What, I I took like opening the door. I took damage. What the heck was that? I don't even know what that was. Hold on, hold on. Give me a second here. I just got taken out by like. What was that? Like some old person with a, a stroller? <laughs> what? <gasps> okay. I was not expecting that. Um. Ha. Huh. Okay. That that just happened. That just happened. All right. I'm not. I'm gonna try not to heal. We're we're, we're gonna try not healing. Um. Okay, where, where, where was I going with that? I, what threw me off was it was, it's a different ghost, right? Uh, we haven't seen that one before. Um, that was that was that was cool. I always love seeing new ghosts. Uh, that was okay. I feel like maybe if I wasn't rushing my way through, like that wouldn't have hit me. So part of me is like, well, if, if I was just playing chill, I I would have been good. But all right, uh, we'll go up the stairs. Uh, I think my main problem with number three. Uh, see, and I, this is kind of goes back to what uh, something I have said previous in previous um, might have been in previous games, might not even have been this one here, is that like the games don't necessarily always need to be fun. It's it's like you know some ho like horror movies and horror stories don't always have to necessarily be fun. Like the idea of being afraid is not actually in of itself fun. It's not a a thing it's not a, an emotion you you kind of desire on its own it is an uncomfortable emotion and i okay well let's let's put the thing down and see what happens i could continue talking later if i remember you set the commandment tome on the altar's book stand there was a sound like th uh that of some sort of mechanism moving from the level above oh, oh wasn't there a trap door that we couldn't get through before maybe we can get through there okay so anyways like b by the genre itself like you you're you're meant to be uncomfortable and i feel like that's what the manner of sleep does by being very maze like and all over the place and it's kind of uh kind of confusing it makes you uncomfortable because you're you always feel lost it's not a, an enjoyable thing and i i in a way like it's i like that it's good it's it's something especially with the idea of dreams it makes sense to sort of the from the design like so that that's kind of cool i can see that being a deliberate choice all right, well, let's pick up the candle. But the problem comes with the second part uh, of how they executed it, where they section off huge... Oh, we can get through that door now. Was there a ghost back here? I feel like I missed it. Darn it. It sounded like it was coming off from that side. Ah, so many missed ghosts. Um... HOLY CRAP, YOU- HOLY CRAP! Duh. Um... Where are you? Oh, whoa! Um... Wait. Okay. Oh, that was kind of trippy. We saw, oh darn it, we saw a bit of like Miku. Um, okay, what's um, what's the slowdown? I I can't remember what the slowdown. Uh, uh charge, 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 charge! Let her loose. Okay. Uh, is it um?
Okay, okay, this is, uh... Okay, let's turn off the slow motion. No, she's there. She's over there. She's gonna come for me. No, she's not. She's moved! Darn it! Oh, yes! I got the shot off! No, I should have charged a bit before... Let's talk more focus on shooting the ghost. <sighs> this one here always does me it, like always gets me. Holy crap. Okay. Let's try going through that door again. <laughs> yes, I like every, well Miku's walking around with her head like over her heart. I'm just like, yes, that's exactly how I feel. I feel like part of the um problem I'm having here is um Controls. Uh, is, okay, what's the? Is there a quick spin button? Okay, that that's a take a picture button. I don't want to take a picture. I I want to know if there's a, because the other the other fatal frames there was a like a quick spin. You could like spin around real quick. Okay, this is a special move. Okay, special. Let's put things down. There doesn't. Is there? Spin around. Wait, is square? I've tried square. Hey, wait, L2? Apparently spin around. Wait, whoa, hold on, hold on. I, I've i tried those. You, you can hear my button. It's not spinning me around. Oh! Holding on the trigger makes your spin faster! So okay, in the in the first um in the, the earlier games there was like a dedicated like 180 180 button where it would just s flip you around really quick. And that's not how this works now. Okay. Anyways, uh we're about to probably get into something new, so no talk. No talkie. I'm not talking. Can I Oh she's gotta keep crouched a bit here just so she doesn't I guess bonk her head. Um, so we go inside here to get the item. Gotta get the item. Something is reflecting light on the floor of the cell where the woman was. Something has been sewn into a part of the kimono. Mirror of Lust. There's the mirror. The back of this old mirror has been engraved with a snake design that looks just like the tattoo. There's an old book on top of the clothes spread out at, on the bottom of the cell. Tattoo Diary 1. My father, my mother, my brother, everyone has gone to the other side. I have been left, all, by myself. Just like that time when I couldn't go with Kaname. An escort came from the Kuze Shrine. Those who know the pain of the loss of loved ones become priestesses, and by surrendering their flesh can save many people who know the same pain. But once you become a priestess and have the pain of the holly engraved into you, you can't leave the shrine. The entire village is gone. Father, mother, my brother, everyone. I am the sole survivor. There is nothing left for me. If it's decided that I can never see them again, then that means that I can sleep for all of eternity. I can save others with the same pain. Okay, so this is, this is written from, I guess, one of the priestesses? This is... You had a tattooed diary one to your file. Inside the shrine. Did you say she's inside the shrine or it's inside the shrine? I missed that. Um, okay, let's just take a look at our notes. A man named Kaname. A diary was left in the prison where the shrine maiden was kept. In it were records. Record, uh, in it were recorded her thoughts and feelings. The name Kaname was written there. The brother's name in the diary of the girl dressed as the shrine maiden was Kaname too. The brother's name in the diary of the girl dressed as the shrine maiden was Kaname too. Did he come to see her? Did he go inside the shrine? Okay, interesting. Yeah. Also of note. Um, Something I, I discovered while I was replaying stuff. Uh, the, um, Yai, the one of the twins that we read about, the one that escaped from the, um, um, the village in the second game, she 
actually is the Hong woman in the first Fatal Frame. So, uh, the, the, the twin who escaped from the village, she ended up getting to, um, Himuro Mansion, and she became one of the ghosts there. Uh, I, so I just thought that was a fun little tie-in I, I picked up while I was replaying the games a bit, and I was like, holy crap! Like, all the games are all connected in this, this kind of cool way. Um, I'm sorry, just like seeing, like, the, the game referenced like a connection, and that, 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 that popped out to me. I was like, oh, I, I love that. Um, anyways, return. But as I was saying, oh, you know what, we're gonna come into something else new. I think the biggest sin the game makes is, oh, now we can go through here. Well, where do we go now? I don't know where we're supposed to go. I don't know. <sighs> Candles running out. Um. Okay, so I'm running around a bit here. To hopefully, like a ghost will lead me somewhere. Uh, because I'm not sure where to go, where I'm supposed to go. Don't know. I feel kind of like. Okay, so the, the um, the biggest sin is uh, I actually understand why they 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 committed this sin. Um, the game because they made the thing such so maze like. They kind of made it a mess to navigate, right? It's it's hard to get around this mansion and to know where you're going. Uh, do we go back to the blind room? Yeah, like I'm, I'm not even sure where to go now. Like. I was supposed to go to the library, but then the library just made it so that we could loop back around. Wait, uh, she said in the shrine, right? So does that mean we have to go actually to the engraving shrine? Uh, do you know what? I'm going with that. That is going to be my assumption. We're headed to the shrine because that's what the little girl just said. Like literally just listen to what the game is telling you. Um, but the way the, uh, it, it, the way the game sections off. Oh, there's two. The way the game sections off uh, areas uh, and makes you take the long route through everything, it's... Oh. Didn't I already... Oh, I thought I missed that one. Oh, no, did I get it? No, I missed the second one. Okay, am I, should I go back to the tree? That's twice now. It's it's drawn my attention to the tree. Candle. No. Okay. Um. Oh, I like I was staying on the screen to to remind me. Um, <laughs> your time is almost up. Uh, basically, because things are so confusing, the game goes ahead and it sections parts off. Right. Um. It. it, it and it, it makes you take the long way around. And sort of, so it's, so it's always sort of like funneling you in a really kind of annoying way. Um, Cause it's like, you go all the way around the mansion, go all the way around, take the long way. And it's making you have to re-navigate things. And that's, it's something that like the previous games have done. They have sectioned off certain parts. It's not completely open. Um, and I understand that you you kind of want since you're you have because this is a rather large area and it loops in on itself. It's very it's almost I kind of hate hate making the comparison, but it's almost like Dark Soulsian uh, in the way that it's designed, where like one area m m feeds into another and connects with this one, and they all they're all sort of connected in some way. Um, uh, and uh, actually, no, that's probably a good uh, comparison. So like, imagine something like. Oh crud. Um, something like Dark Souls or like Metroid, where something opens up but then eventually like in, let's say like Metroid, like they just randomly started closing off doors and forcing you to take the long way around. Like repeatedly. Several times throughout the course of the game. Not not just like once or twice here, like over and over. Oh, 
this is Oh, okay. I need to spin. Crap, I think I missed that one. I need to we'll just do some, do some damage. Oh. I'm running out of my slow motion here. Um, hey, that's my health. There goes my stone mirror. Whoa. Okay, calm down there. It, so it took out my stone mirror and then kept going? Are we gonna have a game over here? Wait, where's my... Oh, wait, didn't I have sacred water and crap? Okay, we're going to type 61. You in frame. Charge, 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 charge. Come on. Oh, now. This is so much easier now that I can quickly. Now that I can do sort of quick turn. Oh, this is so much less. Actually, yeah. This is so much better. Right, the mirror. Man, I'm such an idiot. All right, hurry up, put the thing on the mirror. Or put the mirror in the thing. The altar is arranged with braziers and other equipment used in esoteric Buddhist rituals. In the center lays a pedestal meant to hold a round plate of some sort. There's a small engraving on it. Offer up the mirror etched with the holly of the priestess. You set the mirror of loss on the pedestal. There was a sound from the bamboo screen in the back. It seems the device that was holding the screen in place has been released. Okay, uh, we gotta move. We've got to move. Um, uh, what, what is this? Inside the screens, the bare rock beneath the floor is exposed. It looks like the stone bed in the center, uh, was carved straight out of the rock. Looking closely at the stone bed, I can make out traces of red and purple ink. It looks like a tattooing ceremony took place here. Uh, is there... Oh, there's an item on the ground. There's something on the floor. Type 90 film. Okay, that's great. Um... Alright, I guess we're going through the door? I hate that I used good film, but I feel like... Oh, I was in trouble. Uh, can I save here? The blue flame in the lantern is lit, you can save now. I can't tell, because you've literally, like, drained everything, like... You could have left a little bit of saturation. Part of me wonders also if I should upgrade um, Miku's camera some more. I've got like 73,000 points. Um, but at the same time, it's like I, I want, I like I know Ray is the main character here. So it's like, I'm, I'm like, ah, this is kind of sucks. Always feeling like, eh, yeah, how, how much do I, how much do I, Upgrade here. You know what? I don't know what I'm about to come up against. If I'm if I'm finding myself getting scared enough that I'm upgrading my that film I'm using, and I find like the film is um really scarce in this game. Um, you know, I think upgrading, just sucking it up and upgrading Miku's is probably a good idea, especially like her uh, her slowdown ability. That's really helpful. Um, the charge thing is good, like, max value, yeah, like, I, I, hmm. Let's see, if I upgrade both sensitivity and max value, that's 30,000, uh, that should leave me with, what, 43,000? Uh, I could get, yeah, I could upgrade max value, sensitivity, stone, and double. That's what we're gonna do. I hope I math right. If I did not math right, then, uh, then I, then I am a dumb. I, I did math right. Good. Good on me for mathing right. 
All right, well, we've committed to that. All right, um... Ah, oh, darn it. No, you're not in frame. Okay. All right, we well, guess we're going down. Big door. Now would be a great time to wake up. No one will survive. But we're not waking up. Nope. We're going down. If we don't play as Miku again for like the rest of the playthrough, I'm gonna be so angry. I'm like, I just spent all those points on her camera. I should have waited to see if I got into another fight. I should have waited. Darn it! Okay. No, I committed to it. I, I can't. I, uh, what, am, what am I doing? Oh, okay. We're going to balance across. Ooh. Interesting. Oh no. Oh no, why why is the filament showing up? Oh, there's someone down there? Uh maybe I'll see it once I get on the uh the other side. Oh, there's something. What am I looking at? Oh, there's someone there. That's the, um... The priestess? Uh, the shrine maiden? Whatever. Right, I don't have a stone mirror. Keep that in mind. You don't have a stone mirror. I couldn't make that out. Darn it. Almost sounded like there was two voices, though. Oh, yep, there was multiple voices, all right. Okay, we are gonna... Try to get them all in one spot. Ah, oh, crap! You messed up my follow up shot. Okay, come on. Come on. No, 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 no. Ah! Uh, okay. 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 I'm just gonna keep saying okay. Because that, that, that's, that's a, that's a good, you know, productive thing to do. That, that will help. Absolutely. Wait, uh, I've got my slow-mo. What am I doing? I could be like matrixing this. Yeah, I, I, like... One down. Okay. Save some. The next one's gonna attack you. Uh, where's the other one? So there's two. Charge up, get full charge, and then... Oh crap, you moved. Oh! Did I get them all? I think I got them all. Whew! A lone stake is impaled by itself into the reddened ground. Uh, there, 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 I, a lone stake, there's a whole lot of them! I think, yep, there's there's a whole lot of stakes there. Um, wow, okay. You cannot save right now. Okay. Okay, look at this. Nika opens these, like, she can open doors. That's a reference to earlier in the playthrough. I feel you. Don't go. Don't 
don't go that way any further. I'm sorry. I I left you behind. I'll go there, with you. <laughs> Darn it. Miku! Yep, I knew it! I was like, I just spent all those points on Miku. Watch. Just watch. We're, we're gonna go in her room, and she's gonna be like, comatose. It's gonna be like, oh no! Now we have to save Miku because Miku's out of action, and great. Yay. I spent all them points. Mm. All right. All right, that's fine. That's fine. All right. Uh, wait, wait. Is there a a weird grain over everything right now because I'm looking at like Ray's like arm and stuff yeah there's like this dark like dirty texture over everything <gasps> maybe it's not the walls themselves that I noticed that things were getting grimy it's the lens it's the camera that we're looking through that has become it's got like another filter on top of it Ah, maybe I'm not going crazy. Oh, there's a thought. Um, all right, but I'm looking at the time though. So that, uh, unfortunately, I, I feel like I just started, but we've got to stop again. Ah, uh, man. Um, so we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna stop things here. Um, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you did not, leave it a thumbs down. Either way, let me know what you thought in the comment section. Next time, we're gonna go check on Miku. Uh, and, uh, yeah, probably, uh, observe the cat. Cause you gotta observe the cat. Uh, but until that cat observing time, I would like to ask you all to game on.